pat home on the match tonight. Uh, well worth it, I think. Yeah, no, definitely. Um, it's great to be back at home, good crowd, uh, and get a win before Christmas. Uh, excellent start to the festive season. You had to uh, sort of work really hard the pack because it was always going to be dominated by the, the front eights and uh, you did that really well. Yeah, we uh, we always knew that if the weather conditions were uh, unfavourable that the, the front eight would have to work hard and I think uh, on the whole everyone uh, fronted up and put a really good shift in. Just how difficult is it to play in conditions like that? Yeah, it is difficult, but we uh, we work hard during the week on our moors and our set piece, uh, and we get some really good gains out of there. We get we get the penalties, uh, we get the driving more going, and um, successfully uh, get it going. Yeah, and ten games in now. It, as we were saying before, to the other people interviewed, it couldn't be going much better, really, could it? Yeah, no. Um, uh, I wasn't here last season, but obviously a hell of a lot uh, has changed, and for the better. And um, he's hoping we keep rolling. Yeah, and two tough away games coming up, so it was good to get that win tonight to get some points in the bag. Yeah, totally. Yeah, obviously, uh, Welford Road away uh, after Christmas, um, lots of distractions and that sort of thing around Christmas. But come when we step over the white line, we've got to be uh, ready to go. Just tell us about that. That was dead easy for me. That last scrum, uh, he kind of changed. He reset it about four times there. Gave them four chances to get it right, and then we got it wrong once, and he went against this. How does that feel as a forward? That that kind of thing happening? Yeah, it's uh, it's a hard to take. Obviously, we hit, we're getting the ascendancy in the first three, and then for one reason or another, it goes against us. Um, I think. In hindsight, we could have taken the points, but we wanted to run the clock down, uh, and in the, in the end, it worked. Um, so we can't complain. It's great seeing the scrum set. Everyone is so flat, straight, level. Everything's really tidy there, and it looks good from a from a from a stand point of view. How hard has it been working on that over the summer and pre-season to get our scrum right? Yeah, we've we've had uh, our scrum guru Dan in uh, every week, and we work hard on it technically, and we uh, put the shift in on the scrum machine, and it uh, is paying dividends when we come up against these big packs um, and we get some dominance. That's brilliant. Thank you. Cheers, Pat. Cheers. Thank you.